Hi, welcome back to my channel. Now today I've got a really exciting review for you today. Um, I saw a, an article in the January issue of Scratch magazine and it was for this Arthur Sec new stamping rolling type system. It's different to anything out there that we've got before so I'm really excited to do a first impressions review on it. This is not a sponsored review, it's my honest opinion. So I got sent this little set here which this retails for $19.99 including VAT I believe and then you can get a bigger set um, I also got sent a couple of other little plates which I'll show you and we'll have a go at and they also do their own range of stamping polishes so I have a black and a silver chrome so I'll just open these up and uh, we'll get started just another quick point, you do get a instruction leaflet inside when you uh, order. It's very simple. To be honest, I don't think you really need instructions. Uh, it's pretty self-explanatory, but that's in there if you need uh, any guidance. So that's a good little point. But they also, on the website, they have videos that you can watch as well. Uh, so that's really good. So I'm going to open up now what came in the £19.99 set. So we'll just open this up, so that's how the box is open, quite nifty. So in here I've been sent a, it includes a white polish, uh, so that's good. It's always good to have a white and a black basic colours for stamping. Then the plates we've got, let's have a look. So we have, and as you can see the plates they have uh, the designs printed on top of the plate so you can see what it is you're stamping and what's on there so they're quite easy to see unlike stamping plates where you're trying to look at the image and then obviously excuse I haven't cleaned underneath but there's the uh, images underneath and then what the whole point is is that you roll roll them onto the nail so that's the first plate I have This one looks exciting. This is the second plate. The design's there. And on their website, I see you can order different sets, uh, different collections. Uh, all their collections, uh, they are inspired by different things, by artists, etc. Have a read on their website. Um, have a look. It's really quite different and unique to what we have out there already. And the final plate. Oh, and this one's wrapped. Open this up. Well, this one looks quite exciting. Nice little uh, different types of stamps there. And the thing with these plates as well uh, is that you can change colours and stamp more than one colour on an image so we'll have a go at that this image is on there and then I'll just show you what other stamps I have so I've also got some this one and like you can see on this one it's showing you the images but it's showing you also with different colours on them uh, so it almost gives you an idea if you're unsure of how you want to change and mix up colours in your stamping. You can see that on there. That's very pretty. And then we also have last one. This one here, which is different. I suppose these little circles, etc. You can see them on there. You could almost do like half moons on the on the bottom of the nails there. So that's good. So I'll just get my nail pop set up and uh, we'll have a go at this stamping. Okay, so the first image I'm going to show you, I'm going to stamp one of these images. So I might do this little star there. So... You get the polish, you 
paint it on the image, you cover the image entirely. Scrape on a bit of paper so the image is clear. And then with these little images, it says wait four or five seconds and then you stamp. And there you go. <clears throat> Excuse me. So there's the image. It's been stamped on. Okay, so to do a multicoloured image, it says to start with the dark colour first, but when I've tried that, that hasn't worked. So I'm going to do it with the white first. Paint the white on. Scrape. There's the image there. Remove what you don't want. I'm going to do half white, half black. So that's clean off. Then we're going to get the black. Put that on. Again, scrape. There's the image there. So it's to wait four or five seconds and then you stamp. And there you have it, the half black, half white star. I just want to have a go at one of these little triangles just on the uh, tip of my nail. So I'm going to do it in white. So we'll get the white. Oh, too much white. Paint it on. Scrape. There it is, I'm just going to clean up these bits, we don't want that bit there. And then just stamp on the nail, you see, and stamp. Okay, it's not completely straight, but I am at an awkward angle. There's a bit of a line going on there, but you could always clean it up, you just have to perfect it. So let's give another one a go. So I'll just clean that off. So I'm going to have a go at one of these images, again on my own nail. Now I'll just note, the reason I'm now not using colour pops is that I find it easier because it's totally different to stamping, easier to just stamp directly on my own nail because the nails curved as they should be now with the actual stamps uh, the images like the designs you have to stamp them on and hold and press basically you hold and press on the nail rather than roll um <clears throat> what one should we try let's try this like zebra type print bear in mind i have got nail decal on or nail gem so you cover the image scrape and please note it's very important that you scrape on paper and not on tissue because it will not work if you scrape it on tissue it has to be on paper just clean up the image and then I'm just going to stamp it onto the tip of my nail so we're just going to stamp and hold Okay, I'm at an awkward angle, but you can see, hopefully you can see it there. It's easier if I stamp on mine in white, just so that you can see them. So I'll just clean that off. Now I just want to show you something before I go any further. I've just gone and wiped the top of this with nail varnish remover, and it's wiped off the designs on the top. So do not wipe the top of these with a nail varnish remover as they're not protected. So just a side note. So I'm going to 
just attempt a little French design. Obviously we'll do that in the white. So I'll just paint that on. Scrape. Just clean off this excess. I'm getting lint on them from the uh, wipes. So just be careful with that. So there it is, all cleaned up. And I believe these ones you roll. Sorry, back in focus. So you get it, and we roll. Not the best, but then I am at a funny angle. But that's uh, basically the gist of the. French so I'll clean that up and so the last one I'm going to try is this one and I think I'm going to do the rose again I'm just going to do it in white just because it's easier to see on the nail on camera so we'll give that a go so find the rose there it is get the white cover it scrape it Check the design is clean before you go into the nail because it says to give it a few seconds to dry. There's the image, and I'll stamp at an angle just so it's easier. Stamp. Okay, so it missed off a tiny bit. Um, all I can say about these stamping, uh, after sec stamping discs is it's different it's not anything like uh, a stamping system with a st where you scrape and stamp they are different they have got a different technique you scrape some you roll some you stamp once you're used to stamping this is something totally different and you just have to get your head around that that you have to work different so it's going to take time and practice uh, make sure you re uh, watch their videos online and check those out. They have got instructional videos. I'm going to leave some links uh, in the description bar below. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. It's let you see a bit more about the system. Um, again, if you want, want to know anything, just let me know. Um, so I did have the polishes in the black, the white and the silver. I believe that they currently have 10 polishes of their own uh, that they sell um, with the intent that they are getting more. So it's something you can slowly build up your collection. I believe uh, the plates, if I remember rightly, they're $7.99 including that each. So again, as you choose stamping plates with these, you can go online and select the different plates. You can buy a set the plates etc um, if there's anything you want to ask me just please put it down in the comments below and I'll try and answer that for you this was a review from me I, I have nothing to do with Arthur Sec I just wanted to review this new product because it was something different and I was quite excited about it if you are a subscriber to Scratch Magazine if you read the article there is an offer for a I believe a 15% discount to all Scratch readers, so check out that article in the Scratch magazine to receive your discount. Thanks for watching and I'll speak to you soon. Bye!